Hello lovely people, let's talk about the Ref G4 pedal today. I know I'm always late to the party because the pedal has been around for quite some time, but actually the first time I played this pedal was this year at Henning Pauli's Gear Street. Um, I tried out the sound system by the lovely guys from Combo Audio and uh, although they have a built-in amplifier in their sound system, I wanted to have something like more metal and Henning was like, wow, let me get you some more metal and he jumped out of his whirlpool in his swim trunks, ran up the hill uh, because he, he owns the whole street where he lives, uh, into his studio and brought this pedal. And I was like, oh, wow, I've heard about Ref before, of course, uh, and their legendary amplifiers and all that, but I've never tried it personally. And uh, this changed. I plugged it into the Combo Audio sound system and it, th the sound system has like an eight inch speaker or something and it sounded awesome. And I was like, wow, I need one of those pedals. And what happened? I met Derek at Guitar Summit and he gave me one of these lovely pedals. And he gave me also a shirt. Yes, in medium. Derek, you're a good guy. Thank you. <laughs> Right now we are plugged in into the FX return of this beautiful Marshall amplifier um, because this works perfectly as a preamp because this is like the G4 pedal from the amp, right? Right? Uh, uh, let me check it because I cannot read. I cannot read the display, I'm sorry. Right now we're in the red mode. Let us switch this flick here to the blue mode. You know what? I have a strap. <sighs> I'm sorry, it won't look that cool, but I need a strap because I can tweak the knobs better if I'm standing. I need a table or something where I put the pedals on, you know, like, like professionals do it. We're here, um, the opposite of professionalism. What's the opposite of professionalism? Amateurism? I don't know, I, sometimes I make up words also. I flicked the switch, we were in the red mode and I flicked it to blue. Um, let's compare, let's comp let's compare red and blue. I sped, sorry. Okay, I think blue is a, a little bit less aggressive and it sounds a bit warmer to my ears. Okay, what's the off position?
Not too bad, right? Uh, but I think the blue one is pretty interesting. I like it. Wow, can you play a bit sloppier, please? No, not today. Ha! What I really like about the pedal is the mid knob, because there, th there's magic happening. You can turn this pedal from a Pantera very scooped sound or a just a for all kind of scooped sound to a very mid honky sound. You know, the hard rock kind of 80s, but it, it doesn't sound unpleasant. And I like this, I really like this. Also the gain sounds very mm, creamy smoothie, creamy smoothie. Creamy and smooth. Okay, so right now this pedal is plugged in into the FX return input of the amp. Um, so if you're not the person who likes to put distortion pedals into the FX return of your amplifier, or maybe your amplifier does not have an FX return, um, you, you have to put it in front of the amp, right? Uh, I'm not the biggest fan personally of putting distortion pedals in front of the amp because I, I don't like the sound usually. With this pedal, it is indeed different. It sounds awesome in front of the amp. Uh, I will show you that. I will show you that in a second. All we have to do is pull out the cable out of the effects return and plug it into the input of the amp and there we go. Still battery on the GoPro, that makes me happy. The Ref G4 pedal right now is in front of the amplifier and this is how it sounds. Oh, the switch is in the off position at the moment. And that's how it goes. <laughs> the noise floor is pretty cool, isn't it? I mean, we have gained at max at the moment on the pedal. That's all right. It is fun in front of the amp, and it is fun in the effects return input of your amplifier. I don't know what else to say. I will grab my 7th string. Yeah, buddy. Okay, 
I did not expect that. <laughs> Wow, 7th string and the Ref G4 pedal, good combination. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this useless video. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see us in the next one. Take care. Bye bye!